Artists Respond is an exhibition that looks at the impact of the Vietnam War on American art. It focuses specifically on the period 1965 to 1975. What you'll see in the show is that there were artists of all kinds who were asking the question of, in a moment of, of crisis, of national reckoning, what does art do? Should it stay separate and elevated from real world and current events? Or can it somehow find a way to wade into them? I think visitors might be surprised to see that the show is not entirely photojournalism and protest art. Um, in fact, most of it does not fall into those categories. And it's art that engages with the war through its imagery, um, through its emotional tenor, through its political engagement, and through engagement with broader themes like, like violence and power and mortality. And it also shows the art world at in transition. It's a moment when there is uh, much greater pluralism um, being expressed through the visual arts. People of color and women are increasingly demanding to be heard. It's no accident that you can find that while looking at um, work made in response to the Vietnam War because, among other things, the military draft um, was a really galvanizing political issue for a lot of minority communities. I hope that visitors will experience these pieces as, as powerful, challenging works of art. But I also think the exhibition really encourages you to look at them through the lens of um, this specific historical context. Uh, it's almost like opening a letter from 50 years earlier and being able to hear a voice, read a voice, um, speaking directly to us across time. I really hope that in a way, the experience of walking through the show is almost a kind of time travel where you can either remember or uh, experience secondhand for the first time uh, uh, this moment in American history.